23 to 8 victory over Hood tonight, Glenn Clark with head coach Paul Cantabene. Coach, I know it got a little sloppy there in the second half, but for the totality of the game, what was your assessment of your team's play? I thought we played, you know, great right out of the gate. Thought we did a really good job. I thought our starters did a great job and and really valued the ball. I thought our defense did a good job. You know, Justin made a couple key saves for us, but up, and we faced off really well. And I thought we did a lot of really good things. You know, but we need our second guys when they get in there to play well. You know, they practice well in practice. You, know, you get in the games. It's not their right to play. It's their privilege, and I think they could have played much, much better in certain situations. I thought it got really sloppy at times, and we gave up some goals we probably shouldn't have, and I thought the offensive guys just played real sloppy. So um, we'll practice them up and get better, but, you know, they understand the standard we try to hold them to. You know, Coach, one of the things that MC and I talk about a bit is from the really brutal schedule that you play at the beginning of the year, you have some really important games that are coming up here at the end of the year. Do you feel like this team is trending in, in when the regular guys have been out there in the direction they need to be in order to be ready for the Easterns, the Yorks, those types of games when you get back home? Well, I think we're doing some things really well. You know, I think our goalie's playing well. I think our faceoff guy's playing well. And I think our offense is really respecting the ball now. I think the way we're playing is uh, playing really well. We don't care who scores. We're moving in. I think we got a lot of really – got six or seven really good middies. And I think our attack's doing a really good job. And Ryan is starting to really play well at that attack position and giving us a calming influence down there. And I'm and I think we got a lot of really good parts. So I think we're playing pretty well at this moment, you know. But we still have a lot of big games. So we play this weekend against Widener, then we got to play a pretty decent um, Messiah team. And Eastern's playing pretty well now before we get to York and Alvernia. So you know we got some big games. But I like the way we're playing in general. All right, we need. I need you to walk me through what was going on in your mind at the end of the third quarter as you watch that ball flying through the air, and Nick Mulvey's camped underneath it, but his momentum is taking him the wrong way. Were you at all worried in that moment? Not really, but you know, Nick made not really, but Nick made the catch and got us the ball. So, you know, <laughs> not the, probably way you want to draw it up, but uh, it, it is what it is. I actually thought it was awesome. I thought it was the wisdom of using the pole with his stick to make sure that that ball didn't get carried over the line. I thought it was really important. All right, give me, as you guys head back out of the road, uh, give me one thing that you say is your biggest focus for this team before you get back here to Mustang Stadium that you want to have improved before those big games. Well, I think we just got to continue to, you know, play well in the offensive end. Us playing well in the offensive end is a great defense for us, you know what I mean? So we think we've done a good job and just maintaining that and not turning the ball over silly and uh, giving up breaks. I thought we've done a great job of that. So we need to focus on playing great offense, you know, win the faceoff, play good offense, score goal, win the faceoff, play great offense, score goal. I think that's the best way. We've done a really good job of going on runs that way, and I think our guys are respecting that. It's hard to beat you when you do those things. All right, Coach, congratulations on a nice win tonight. We'll see you back here in uh, almost two weeks. Thanks. Thanks a lot.